these words pop up in my mind, then everything goes black. Why well, do you have to make it about race, huh? Well, because our rightful rulers deserve recognition. <laughs> And thank God, we've been more peaceful because of it. And think about this. B- black people own the world, and guns are legal, and crime is down. Map oh. that one out. Oh, but Teslas haven't been outlawed yet. No, we're still trying to find Elon Musk, who's <laughs> locked himself in a bunker. You, get up! Oh, ow! <laughs> ow! Someone smacks me in the head, and my consciousness returns full force. Huh? Oh, what? I thought I died. Why'd you go ahead and do that? <laughs> I realized that I'm on the ground. The sweet icy grip of death has not taken me yet. Though a cold, beautiful embrace will soon come. My body is in pain right now, though. But seeing as I was hit by a car going at that speed, I'm pretty much uninjured. Oh, what about the mother and daughter? They never existed. It was all in your head. <laughs> what? <laughs> You should worry more about yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Although you escaped by being hit, escaped being hit by a hair, you still hit your head on the ground. I wasn't hit, but the car was too close for me to get away. <laughs> no, it was still on the road. What? It was on the road this whole time. It never left the lane. Telling me this, she jerks her thumb at something behind her. I see a car driving along the road. <laughs> Let's see how long we can keep this going. <laughs> what did Catlin just say? Oh, that's why I brought up my backlog. Is this her doing? Did she reverse time? <laughs> Compared to the pain I felt at the blow from Diablo's tail, this was nothing more than a mosquito bite. However, it's not a hit that the a hit that the average person could have lived to talk about. As you lack proper wrestling training, you could have been blasted to dust. Oh, it could be more right. There's a lot to take in, and my mouth hangs open in shock. My lower jaw dropping to the floor, my eyes going boing outside <laughs> of my just, skull. And she just like jumped into the street to wrestle the car. Mm-hmm. We truly are from two very different federations i knew she came from another world so it should be obvious but this situation another what it's this is in my head oh, you don't okay. get to go in here okay, okay no okay, no no sorry. no sorry but this situation really makes that point at home simultaneously i make a vow to myself to be careful to never ever ever Make her angry. Oh, watch out if you to, make her angry. To her, ending my life could just be, like, funny. <laughs> uh, I guess you saw me make an idiot of myself. <laughs> Whoops, I'm always imagining mother and daughters when they're not there. <laughs> not at all. Come on now. Catlia stretches her hand towards me. Cool. Thank you. You're just like a new wrestler after their first show. I like how you can see a very brief glimpse of her I panties. wasn't going to say anything, but you're right, Ed. <laughs> I, I'm almost kind of shocked you can't. Except also not. They, they were like, they're like, we haven't seen her panties in a while. Let's let's give him let's give him a little snack. Yeah. <sighs> Some, t- something to hold them over until the next one. <laughs> Catlia shares these words with me with a smile on her face. This is the first time I've ever seen Catlia smile since I met her. <laughs> She's like, come with me, let's take ibuprofen together. Oh, fuck yeah. <laughs> Unwittingly enchant- enchanted by her beauty, I completely forget about taking her extended hand. Nope. What's wrong, brother? Oh, oh. it's nothing. You're just so white and beautiful. <laughs> God, my uh-huh. ivory queen. <laughs> yeah. Please. Oh, uh, white people. Coming to shout my out own, to all the white me. people. Yeah, shout out to all the white people out there. I'm sorry yeah. you lost the war. <laughs> nope. <laughs> God, I hope I got that got picked up. Anyway, coming to my senses, I grab her hand after she helps me up to my feet. <laughs> Let's just see what Alexa said in the my, chat. My snow bunny wife. Oh. After she helps me up to my feet, I check my surroundings once more. Although the speeding car is still going, 
It seems the driver survived the crash of her just wrestling it with light injuries. The mother and daughter I imagined are safe. And luckily, no one else is hurt. Oh, that's a relief. Yes, you were just tweaking. It appears that I have underestimated you. <laughs> okay, okay. Underestimated me how? I actually would love to see how you spin this, given the context we've given this situation. Honestly, I took you for nothing more than someone who was sober. Oh. <laughs> okay. However, I saw the spirit of a proud wrestler in you when you courageously dove in front of nothing. <laughs> Wrestlers have to be good actors to win over the crowd or at least get a good reaction out of them. Wow, I'm... I'm amazed you pulled that off. It helps when you're cutting a promo. Cool, okay. It's the spirit of the wrestler within you that gave you the ability to do just that. It's not something that just anyone is capable of. You should be proud of yourself. Uh, I guess so. <laughs> Why don't you start with your manner of speaking first? After all, there's no hierarchy between us. Not unless we get in the ring. Ah, but we wouldn't because you'd kill me instantly. Yes, I would. We laugh. But after she said <laughs> that, <I s> <laughs> when she said that, I suddenly realized I haven't been aware of it until now. But when speaking with Catley, I've always used a polite tone. Usually I'm <laughs> really uh -huh. mean. Usually I have zero respect for women, but oh. Leah is different. No, I kind of liked actually Ed for a minute. Don't make him a misogynist. <laughs> Our initial meeting made such a big impression on me. If someone sticks a sword to your throat and doesn't buy you dinner first, you tend to speak to them politely after that. As opposed to lovingly, because yeah. that's when courtship begins. We'll be living together from now on. There's no need for such a formal attitude. Uh, I suppose you're right. I mean, right. I suppose you're white. I mean, right. <laughs> Well, you can be both, I guess. <laughs> I'm counting on you, Catlia. Indeed, brother. We clapped our hands like old Romans do. What is this sense of embarrassment I'm feeling? I feel my face growing red. Mom's spaghetti. Just like when I confessed <laughs> my feelings to a girl in middle school and she said, no, never, ugh, never, oh God. God. And then she threw up. I was rejected, by the way, hence her reaction and spent the whole night crying into my pillow the whole week actually i think i spent the, the whole night in jail because she also called the cops on me oh my god <laughs> after our exchange i suddenly realized what a crowd of people had gathered around us the focus of all the eyes is obviously catlia oh my god is that a wrestler hey is that the, is that what it is what wait it was that girl who was dressed like a wrestler she's the one who came in and stopped the the, the Tesla drive it along like it was nothing with a punch. No way, man. You must have been dreaming. I swear I saw it with my own eyes. Are you twicking, bro? No, I'm... Com well, not yet. <laughs> Unless I find a good party. So okay. waiting for the edible to hit. We're, we'll be in trouble if the edible hits. Before there's too much of a fuss, getting out of here seems like the wise choice. Miss Catlia, over here. Let's take the back street, back streets, back, it's back, back oh, right. to get home. After waving a hand at the at the imaginary space I once <laughs> saw a family, Catlia and I headed to the back streets of Akihabara in an attempt to avoid the crowd. Don't worry, the GameStop shouldn't be here. Though rumor has it, it moves based on the whims of those who. No, nope, I guess we made it home all right. Nice. Catlia and I, having run home to escape the ruckus in Akihabara, decide to look at the grimoire and get more firm grasp of its contents. Well, we know that interdimensional well, travel. Well. What? It's, it's escape the ruckus. Oh, Uncle I see. Ruckus. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, but without the necessary magic power, we'll never be able to cast the spell, which is why we need to find out how to obtain enough magic to make it happen. Ah! Kill me! Yeah. No, not not that again. Now, now what? 
A few hours had passed and she started reading the book and I can't count the number of times I've heard this phrase of hers since then. I decoded the encrypted part of this, but it is nothing but a cooking recipe. What kind of mage is this to go out of- What? What kind of mage is this to go out of his way to encrypt the recipe? Well, mages Looked up are- in his mama's recipe. Mages are notoriously quirky, and they also love codes and encryptions. Just funny stuff. Anyway, sorry. Should I, should I tell the mages watching this? Yeah. Shout out yeah. to all the mages. Also, never mind. Who knows? <laughs> okay. Someone who doesn't want anybody to know about it, I guess? I absolutely cannot make heads or tails of this. This is just yet another waste. Wait, what? This is just yet another waste of my time? Kylie has basically been like this since she started reading the grimoire. The author had apparently encoded just about anything from recipes and instructions on making children's toys to idle complaints about his neighbors at the time. Oh I, my god! I kind of loved the guy. And I think his name was Tyrone. <laughs> okay. <laughs> ah, well, for now, at least there's one thing I understand. The author of this book came over to this wrestling federation about 400 years ago. Cool. I mean, 400 years? Back when Vince McMahon or whoever were ruling. It's written that there were even more people with a status similar to wrestlers who were called samurai. God, I'm sorry. Just Cole said Tyrone the tantalizing, <laughs> and I just love that. Also, yeah, anyway. 400 years ago when the when the I, I don't actually know what she said when the Shogun oh no no I mean like because the way you read it he wouldn't understand that was I was heavily implying not even implying just straight up stating that wrestlers in her world and samurai in this world had the same status yes but he doesn't understand that because he used wrestler names that don't exist oh okay this is in canon Ed okay 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 okay, okay. I'm surprised that a book written by someone who lived so long ago survived until now looking good as new did she say something about a spell to prevent deterioration? <sighs> Once again, I'm faced with the reality of how convenient magic actually is. The only bottleneck being that I can't use it without the predisposition for it. The person who wrote what that already went back to his own federation, right? That's so it appears. Immediately after the death of it. No. What? What? Whoa. Why did you? Oh. Why did they word it like this? Oh, maybe he was gay and she wasn't sure how to say it. Oh, you can okay. say partner. That's <laughs> okay, fine. Okay. Immediately after the death of his partner, he left his <laughs> child and tra traveled there alone. I just love the idea. <laughs> so, okay, you're on your own, kid. See ya. I know. I love this wizard so much. That's so funny. <laughs> Even if he did manage to get back home, that story is just too depressing. From the perspective of the abandoned child, it must have been like losing two parents at once. The author's feelings towards his partner and his child are written on the final page of the grimoire, and it hasn't been encrypted. It doesn't seem like the heartbreaking parting that you seem so distressed about. Okay. And I'm not distressed. I never said I was distressed. I'm not distressed. I'm not. There's nothing to be ashamed of. You can feel the feelings of another, and that is because you are kind. Oh, thank you. That's actually really nice. But being told You're that an empath. Okay, I didn't like the way she worded it, but being told that directly to my face is making me feel even more embarrassed. Anyhow, the information we gained from the grimoire wasn't much more than that. As to the most crucial method of gathering magical power, Catley refuses to tell me the secret method that's written in the book, and all I can see are stick figures that look like they're, I don't know, like bashing into each other? <laughs> they're like 69ing? What is this? Yeah. We must find another way to amass magic. There's nothing that comes to mind? Now, after all, you found that Grimmer right away with your magic detention spell, right? I was merely lucky. I've tried detecting other magic already, but I haven't gotten the slightest reaction otherwise. Oh. 
In order to gain magic, we'll have to gather the magical energy in the atmosphere or defeat a monster which possesses its own hidden magic. Monster. My eyes monster. Go, okay. My eyes grow wide as the words from a wrestling world or federation are thrown into the conversation. Wait a minute. The fact that I'm discussing spells, magic, and other federations as if they were normal conversation topics is already fantastical enough. It's an aberration that's born from a pool of magical energy. However, since there's no magic in this war, in this federation, it may not be of consequence. Okay. Oh. Sorry, you're boring me. After saying this, Catlia suddenly sighs deeply. I'll show you boring when I choke you out. Oh, please. No, oh, never mind. <laughs> the subjugation of monsters is another one of the important duties we of the Order, the Order of Wrestlers, are given. Fighting monsters, huh? That is sick as hell. It's almost like monster hunting. Wow. If only there cooler. was a simulator like that in this world, but I'm sure it does not exist. Well, <laughs> I actually have good news for you for once. Oh, shit. Yeah. It seems like being in a game, but for Catlia, I'm sure that's simple, undisputed reality. In our world, there's no such thing as monsters, at least not since 1968. <laughs> what? At least I've never heard of a strange creature suddenly growing out of a pool of magic. That's not how our monsters came about. The wrestlers can't possibly subjugate every monster. We must sometimes borrow the strength of adventurers and soldiers as well. I'm not fond of that. I'd rather hunt those monsters myself, make armor out of their skin, and weapons out of their bones. It makes me feel alive. All right, I just finished. Thank you. <laughs> What's wrong with it if they're willing to help, though? They're fighting. Their wrestling has no conviction. I don't trust those who would wrestle for money. Having gotten in a huff, Catlia coughs to clear her throat, does another protection. <laughs> I am aware of my mullishness. Even amongst my own order I of wrestlers, there are those who would welcome them with open arms. I think it's mulishness because she's being stubborn. Mulishness. However, no matter what my comrades think, I can't lie to myself in the face of my own pride, brother. Okay, well, what's wrong with what they do? You are being a bit stubborn, sure. But everyone has their own standpoint. Yours is just the commander of the group, so... Now that I think of it, I wonder how old Catley is. I had this feeling she was over 18, but... <laughs> something tells me she's if still... Only, if only there was a sign or something, you know, that, that let me know that every character in this game was 18 years old or older. God, I want to die. Something tells me <laughs> that she's far too young, considering her position of commander. I feel hesitant about directly asking a girl her age, because I guess despite my best efforts, I'm still pretty old-fashioned. But I decided to try and figure out in a roundabout fashion. How old were you when you came to be, be can't, how, 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 how old, how old were, hey guys, Spit I think it I'm out. having, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, <laughs> how old were you when you became the commander, Catlia, Jesus, the perfect phrasing, if I do say so much, <laughs> <laughs> this can, this, this, fuck, this way I can naturally confer age and I can avoid upsetting her at the same time, Ugh. oh boy, I am, this rules. This is awesome. Surprisingly, she answers me without the slightest pause. I became the commander when I was 15. Wow. And how many galactic years has it been since then? <laughs> You're not going to say your, your line? 15? Okay, thank you. I understand your shock. I became the talk of the whole wrestling federation for becoming the youngest commander in history. Catlia looks a bit smug saying this. I don't blame her. And rather than simply, simply young, it sounds like she was just a kid. 15 means about the age of a middle schooler, right? 
That just proves how talented she must have been. No, it's high schooler. Yeah, I guess yeah. so. I've continued gaining experience ever since then, but I realized more and more what a novice I am. One of my shoes must endeavor. What? Oh, one oh, never mind. Shoes, I misread yeah. it. One in my shoes must endeavor to improve oneself day in and day out. What do you mean? I'm from a wrestling clan that has been producing wrestlers for generations. I cannot behave in a way that would bring shame to my name now, can I? Oh, you mean like that? I told my head to the side, unable to find a proper response. Probably because the idea of clan or wrestling lineage or whatever has never held any interest for me. I killed my family and danced around oh, with my shirt off, <laughs> just their blood my on my abilities. face, like a little goblin. <laughs> I was able to summon my grandfather, who was the greatest assassin Holy of, the, shit. of the old age, and he brought about a dark era for a time. Oh my god. God, that was fun. Anyway, I do go to visit my family grave periodically, but in the end, it's nothing more than you, just one of those things you do. I see that you don't care much about family lineage. Is everyone in your federation like that? No, no, not exactly. I'm sure there are many people in this world who highly value family lineage and ancestors and, like, not killing your parents. I see. That case exists as well. <laughs> <laughs> What? I can't wait for the end of this to just have the whole lore book. <laughs> Callie and not satisfied with my answer. It's not that she'd shown any contempt. She just looks a little shocked at how different our values are. Yeah, I kill people. <laughs> <laughs> Unlike me, you take family lineage and that kind of thing pretty seriously, don't you, Callie? Of course! We're disciplined fat for a young age to live the life of a wrestler and not to follow the ways of the clan! Hearing this, a small doubt pops up in the back of my mind. But why you, Kalia? Oh, oh. Ba, ba, ba. I guess I couldn't escape my misogyny, and unfortunately, as Eliza had pointed out earlier, Actually, Ed isn't just a rat bastard. He is a misogynist. It looks like we were all wrong. No, anyway. no, no, no. You, you read it wrong. She said, actually, Ed is just a rat bastard, not a misogynist. Oh, no, I was saying uh, opposed to what Eliza was oh, positioning. Oh, 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 oh yeah. okay, yeah. And we're talking about actually Ed, like the character named actually Ed. Not no, I thought we were actually talking about me. you. What the fuck? <laughs> I always thought it's men who become knights. Can we, can we talk about that? I'm guessing uh, female wrestlers might be normal in your world? No! Even in my own wrestling Boo. federation, a lady wrestler is not a common thing. Boo! This They're sucks. much more common in Mexico and Japan, fun fact. Interesting. So you still have Mexico and Japan in your <laughs> world? <laughs> I'm so magical wrestling Mexico and magical wrestling Japan. That's right. That's cool. I actually, I also have no male siblings, you see. So it was my duty to be the next in line in our clan. Okay, that's all right. Luckily, I have many younger sisters, so our clan's name is unlikely to die out. Oh, come I on. No. Okay. Jesus. I shall take up the mantle of wrestling hood as the next leader of our clan. This sucks. We're gonna have a bunch of lady wrestlers running around. That's cool. Um, so you mean you won't get married or like pound genitals or anything? No, I'm saving myself for an orgy. Nice. Okay, I wasn't expecting <laughs> you to go. That's awesome. Good for you, man. Such is wrestling hood. So long as I am able to raise one of my... Oh. Okay. So long as I am able to raise one of my sister's children to carry on the clan name, then my role shall be fulfilled. Jesus fucking Christ, was this game written in the 1800s? I think, I think so. Also, holy, holy shit. shit! Look what I know. I like, I like how we noticed it at the same time. <laughs> That's awesome. MB, I'm gonna put that in the video. That's Please fucking do. awesome. Thank you so much. Artist we got live fan art made. We got, we got fan art made in real fucking time That's as we so were like cool. recording. This shit, this rules. God, 
I've never oh. been happier. Uh, or see, just the Royal Rumble sub sex. That's true. That's, that's true. That's the game Thank I you. wish we were playing. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, okay, we're gonna just kind of glance past this. Yeah, atrocity. we're done here. I feel a bit dizzy listening to Catley explain all this with a dead serious expression. Can only imagine how society would react if someone said this now. It is. Yeah, they'd probably be like, "Why are you still so fucking close-minded?" <laughs> yeah. This isn't just me not reflecting how much of my family and its ancestors. Her views are just hugely different from those of your average person in modern society. Catley, are you okay with that? Of course, that is my wish. What odd questions you ask? If, no, I'm not okay with it, but I am binded by law to say that I am. Well, as long as by law, I guess I don't care. What is this statement? <laughs> It's just a different kind of life, I guess. No, you shouldn't no. act change. <laughs> We're literally from different worlds. It's not like something I should stick my nose into. No, you should. No, 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 <laughs> what the fuck do you mean? Send, send her back, send her, let her realize. This, this motherfucker said that's none of my business, okay? Yeah, not my chair, not my problem, the game. <laughs> and it's not like I've considered that getting married is life's great happiness. Oh. Anyway, I'm getting in the bed. Oh! Oh, a bath! A, mar a marvelous suggestion to see the next CG. Kelly gets excited as soon as I mention a bath. In my federation, it is courteous to send the bathtub up to one's shoulders. May I assume that the custom is similar in this world? I don't know what you're asking, to be honest. So, that's the line. Okay. I mean, I'd be fine with the shower as well, so... When faced with Catley's eyes sparkling in excitement, I find it impossible to suggest we avoid filling up the bathtub. Are we gonna... Huh? When did I fall oh. asleep? When did I fall asleep? Did she when did I fall me asleep? Out? Did she choke me out? Wow. I guess we'll find out in the next episode of Visual Nova. Yes, we will. Save that shit, baby. Okay. It's probably the S. Catlia! <laughs> oh! <Yeah. laughs> uh, how do you do this? Yo, go back, go back, go back, go back. Go back to like, to like the, the regular game. And then it's like, I think it's the symbol, it's this S. Yeah, see, there you go. Pick your favorite number. Really? <laughs> okay. That's fine. I don't care. It's it's your safe pal. I don't care. <laughs> All right, everybody. I hope everyone has a good fucking time. <laughs> All right. Well, that's it. If you're enjoying this playthrough, don't forget to tell your friends about us. Uh, um, like, comment, subscribe. We love you very much. Um, help us um, help us improve the channel. Help us grow. What are you doing, Connor? <laughs> Next recording Fine. session, everything's going to be all quiet. I hope that you realize this. What is the sound effect the bigger than the, the background music? Okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, cool. All right, we're done. Tell your friends about us. We love you very, very much. And we'll see you next time. Bye, Bye. everybody. <laughs> that hurts? What do you mean that hurts? Heroes join the operation from different planets and different nations. There's an intergalactic federation to monitor the situation. Catch each and every confrontation. Only broadcast on this day.